besides old mayor doing here because I'm a little rusty at this stuff. I haven't done it for many, many, many years. But I want to congratulate not only the Recreation and Park Department and Phil's outstanding leadership and the people that are all part of making it a success, but the reason I'm here as an old mayor coming out of retirement to say some words about an extraordinary event that happened here in the South of Market, as well as an extraordinary group of San Franciscans who did something very special, that this is just the latest example uh, and manifestation of. Several years ago, as Seth told you, uh, their tennis club, the only place you could play tennis inside in San Francisco, uh, was threatened with elimination, with being wiped out by many of the forces that we see today going on all over the city where extremely valuable property is being bought up that uh, is being increased in value and function to uh, develop high-rise office development or high-rise market rate expensive housing. The tennis club over here a couple blocks away, as Seth said, was the latest example of that, but the tennis players said that's not going to happen to our facility that has been here for over 50 years and providing recreation desperately needed in this city. So they went out to the people of San Francisco and asked for help in the form of signatures that they gathered some 18 to 20,000 all over the city to give them the leverage that allowed them to negotiate with the developers that were about to wipe out their project. All they had was the people of the San Francisco and the signatures on petitions. That was enough to create a even level field for a bargain between the developer and the tennis club. And so they negotiated over a 72 hour period and when they were finished, the tennis club was saved. The developer said, we'll put the tennis club back when we put our new building up and uh, you can have your tennis club. That wasn't enough for the membership and the board of the tennis club because they wanted to say thank you to the people of San Francisco for giving them the power to negotiate a successful outcome of their issue with development. And so they said, we want some money to pay back, to reward, to thank the people of San Francisco. And so they got a million and a half or so dollars, a couple of million, 1.8 million, to resurface as their partners and in the Rec and Park Department showed them all over the city to make repairs to tennis courts, basketball courts, and things like we're celebrating today. Think about that. Think about that. They got what they wanted. They saved their building. They saved their tennis club. But that wasn't enough. They wanted to say thank you to Rec and Park, to the people of San Francisco. And so we're here today. And this is not the first. It's the sixth, seventh, eighth, seventh event like this where we are celebrating the San Francisco Sports and Recreation Organization 